and see how to solve the mixed system of linear and quintic equations. Naive way would be from the first equation, we solve y in terms of x. So y equals 2 minus x. Plug into the second equation, we will get a single quintic equation. But it turns out it is hard to solve. So let's use a simple trick by means of a symmetry. From the first equation, x plus y equals 2. We do a simple substitution. Let x equals 1 plus a. Then y would be 1 minus a, right? Now we plug into the second equation. So we get 82 equals x to the power 5 plus y to the power 5. And we know x is 1 plus a to the power 5 plus y, 1 minus a to the power 5. Now we use a binomial expansion, so we get 1 plus 5a plus 10a squared plus 10a cubed plus 5a to the power 4 plus a to the power 5. For the second term, 1 minus 5a plus 10a squared minus 10a cubed plus 5a to the power 4, finally minus a to the power 5. Now let's correct like terms. a to the power 5 minus a to the power 5 cancelled. 5a to the power 4 plus 5a to the power 4, so we get 10a to the power 4, 10a cubed minus 10a cubed cancelled. 10a squared plus 10a squared, so we get 20a squared. 5a minus 5a cancelled. Finally, 1 plus 1. We get 2. The other side is 82. Both sides subtract 82, so we get 10 a to the power 4 plus 20 a to the power 2 minus 80 equals 0. Both sides divided by 10, so we get a to the power 4 plus 2 a squared minus a equals 0. We can view a squared as a single variable back to it. So we get a squared plus 4 times a squared minus 2 equals 0. So we have two possibilities. If a squared plus 4 equals 0, then a squared equals minus 4. No real solutions because the square of any real number should be positive, should be non-negative. For the second case, if a squared minus 2 equals 0, then a squared equals 2. Take square root, so we get a equals plus minus square root of 2. Finally, we can get back to x and y. If a equals square root of 2, then x equals 1 plus a, so 1 plus square root of 2 y equals 1 minus square root of 2. If a equals negative square root of 2, then x equals 1 minus square root of 2. y equals 1 plus square root of 2. So we get two solutions to given equation. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.